my name is Kiran Makkar and today I'm going to share with you ideas for a cue card that has been added recently in the speaking test of the IELTS. The topic is describe a change that will improve your local area. What is the change? How will the change work? What kinds of problems will it solve? How do you feel about the change? Change is the law of nature. Ever since the earth has been formed, life has evolved and changed. Every individual, society, city and country needs to bring about changes and accept changes in order to grow and progress. Change might be a struggle in the beginning, but someone has rightly said that if there is no struggle, then there is no progress. I would like to talk about one such change that will greatly improve the quality of life in my local area. The change is to implement the traffic rules more strictly and to solve all the problems related to traffic. The traffic in my hometown has worsened over the last few years. There has been a drastic increase in the congestion and accidents on roads. This is mainly due to an increase in the number of vehicles on roads and people not following the traffic rules and regulations. There are no new rules that are needed as there are enough rules already. What is needed is that the condition of the public transport be improved so that more people use it. As a result, the number of vehicles on the roads will decrease. There should be cameras installed at all traffic signals and intersections. This way, the fines can be mailed to the registered addresses of those who break the rules. This will lead to a major reduction in road mishaps that occur due to people breaking the rules or people not following the rules. The traffic will be smooth and there will be no congestion. What is needed is more awareness among people about why the rules are needed. The rules have been made for the benefit of the general public and not to inconvenience them. This can be done by having traffic police personnel going to schools and educating the students about the various rules and their importance. This might be difficult for people initially as they have become habitual of not following the rules. However, once they realize that it's for their benefit and for improving their life, everyone will readily accept it and change their habits. I have joined a local NGO which organizes sessions at schools to make children aware of the importance of following traffic rules and educate them about the traffic signs. I hope to see this change in my hometown soon. Progress is impossible without change and those who cannot change their minds cannot change anything. George Bernard Shaw So this was uh, uh, the cue card I prepared for this. You can omit the uh, quotation in the end if you find it difficult to speak. Uh, I think it's um, uh, the ideas are enough to go two minutes. You have to prepare any topic for two minutes. And now I'll be discussing some follow-up questions. Do changes always lead to a positive result? Well, it is not uh, so. Change can be positive and it can be for the negative. But uh, what is certain is that change is going to happen. Whether we like it or not, whether we realize it or not, change is always uh, happening all around us. And uh, uh, it can be positive or it can be negative. How has your hometown changed in the past 10 years? My hometown has changed a lot in the past 10 years. Two flyovers have been built. The railway station and the bus stand have been re renovated. Uh, many new educational institutes have opened. Many shopping malls have opened. So there has been a lot of change in the past 10 years in my hometown. Why is it difficult for some people to make a change in their lives? 
well i think it is difficult for some people to make a change in their lives because they they um they want to play it safe they don't want to take any risks and uh, secondly they may be just lazy they don't want to change they are satisfied with their life as it is going on are there any changes you want to make this year well i really want to add an hour of gym in my daily routine this is the change i really want to make this year in my life do you think governments should spend more money in making a city more beautiful definitely government should spend more money in making a city more beautiful because uh, everyone likes beauty and uh, uh, everything should have an aesthetic appeal and uh, also then people will like to go out in the parks for walks and all if it is more beautiful it is also good to attract tourism for any uh, to any city what are the disadvantages of people knowing each other in a small village well in a small village we have the community spirit and everybody knows everybody but uh, the disadvantage uh, can be that uh, people may not have any privacy in their lives at all and uh, even if they don't like it everybody uh, might be interfering in their lives so i think i i can think of only this disadvantage otherwise um, seeing the isolated lives in the cities i think this should be taken in the positive light and that everybody knows everybody and everybody is helpful towards everybody thank you